Mario Slagmaster fans, continuing with the Emmanuel series starring Natasha Vermeer. This is Emmanuel, Jesse's Secret Desires. Let's check it out. We're in L.A. Alexis, so sexy, so Hollywood. This is Jesse talking, I believe. My name is Jessalyn Morgan, and I'm a criminal defense attorney. I surround myself with criminals, murderers, rapists. My friend Emmanuel tries to help. But still, I am haunted by images. Images that make me both afraid and there she is, Jessie. She's constantly seeing images, dreams of beautiful women. Thanks, Emmanuel. I'm really sorry I had to cancel dinner. I just have a lot of work to do. That's the actress okay. Beverly Lynn. She's talking to her friend Jack on the phone, who apparently is watching her, or... I think we got some sort of phone sex about to happen. She's watching somebody through some binoculars, and then she, maybe somebody's watching her, who knows. Fast forward a little later, here she is in her office. Jesse, yes, Kim. Jesse, someone sent you flowers this morning. Really? Where are they? They were dead. This is Russell Wilson, so? not the quarterback. What can I do for you? My girlfriend. My ex-girlfriend. Why do you need a lawyer? The district attorney seems to think I had something to do with it. I'm sure he's been in our bedroom. Come on. We have witnesses that saw them fighting at Dido's hours before she went missing. He grabbed her wrist and he didn't want to let her go. She was leaving him, Jess. Did your client tell you that? Emmanuel, he's got to be the most beautiful man I have ever seen. Does he remind you of the man in your dream? Maybe. He's tall and he's got beautiful eyes. Five years. He was supposed to serve 15. So he should be happy. You would think that he would be. So what's the problem? The thing is, when he got convicted, he swore in front of the entire courtroom that when he got out, he'd come after me. He swears he's innocent. Another gift arrived. So does she have a former client, former prisoner, who's trying to get revenge on her? Jesse. Oh my God, Jack, thank God it's you. What's wrong? Um, nothing, you know, I'm, I'm just being a little paranoid, I think. I'll be right there. That's okay. her boyfriend, Jack. Jack comes over, they have some fun. She conducts further interviews. But now that I think about it, she did disappear for a while. Her friend Dana came up to me looking for her. Get out. How'd it go? Fine. It's late. It's time to go. I don't think so. Come here. Oh, God, you're hurting me! I thought you liked it like Let that. Let go! It's the rope burns from last night. Is this interview a suspect too? Here's the waitress, I believe. I think Rain has some information that might help you. Oh, uh, Rain, this is Jesse Morgan, my ex-wife. Nice to meet you. You too. Um, Slater told me about your case, and well, I was working that night. In fact, I waited on them. Look, I can't work like this. If there's something that you're not telling me, then I'll be honest. There's not. Hey, there's nothing. I swear. fantasies about him though. I guess Jesse has fantasies about women too. I don't know what this has to do with the plot, but whatever. Alright, I'll get my baby. Well, honey, I'm right here. 
right here. What's on my car? Next time it will be your... At the camera. I have a subpoena for it and as well as all the tapes from the past week. Wait right here. I'll get it for you. better things to do. Stop it. Oh, so you want to play that game? Serious, Dana. Oh, God, I've missed you. Where's Anna? Should I be? No. She's happy with Jack Parker, and I'm happy with you. She's with who? Jack Parker. Do you know him? Her name sounds really familiar. Yeah, I know. He's a cop, isn't he? The movie features several love scenes. Now this is her former client, the one she's been scared of. Hi, hey, Jesse. It's okay that I call you Jesse, isn't it? What's wrong? Cat got your tongue? You stay away from me. The police are on to you and, and, and they're going to be here any minute. What do you want? I've been trying to get in contact with you. You've been avoiding me. I wanted to tell you I'm sorry for what I said in the courtroom. What? I was innocent. And I stand by that. But it wasn't your fault I got convicted. There he is. It's Jack. What is he doing there? There's no doubt. He went after her. I can't believe it. If Jack's responsible, then Jesse's in big trouble. Wait, he's up, Jack! Jack! Jack, stop! Jack! What are you doing? What are you doing? I'm protecting you. What does it look like? The guy's bad news, right? We wouldn't want anything to happen to one of our friends, does Jack, it's okay. He didn't come here to hurt me. It? Yeah, it's her boyfriend Jack who's been stalking her. I think you should go, Jack. Manuel to the rescue. Anna's not missing. We found her. Anna and I are the same. Oh, I'll explain to you later. Are you, are you okay? Yeah. Should be fine. Jesse, I'm really sorry about all this. Will you be alright? Ends with a love scene with uh, Jesse and her new client. And that's. Alright, what we got here is the. Uh, uh, fifth series of the Emmanuel series, uh, starring Natasha Vermeer. Um, sometimes it's called The Private Collection, and this is, I believe, the second movie in that series. Uh, it was called uh, Emmanuel, Jesse's Secret Desires. And this one, Emmanuel actually has a very small part. Uh, her friend, Jesse, Jessalyn Morgan, I think is her name, is some sort of district attorney, and she, or and she's, uh, actually she's a defense attorney, I believe, and she has a new client who um, is accused of I don't know what he is, but his girlfriend is missing, or this girl is missing. This one's weird. Um, so, she consults her friend Emmanuel, of course, who, like I said, has a very small role in here. Beverly Lynn plays uh, Jesse, and um, somebody keeps sending Jesse, like, notes and things about, uh, like, she gets this note, uh, uh, or she gets these dead flowers sent to her. She gets a note left in her car saying the next one's going to be your throat, uh, and then they slashed her tires. She gets this baby doll with some holes in the head um, sent to her, and she thinks it might be an ex-client of hers who uh, just got out of jail recently. He was on a five-year stretch. He was supposed to get 15. He got her off, or he, she got her, she got him down to five, but apparently he told the courtroom, I'm going to take revenge on you once I get out. So she thinks it might be this guy. Um, she has a boyfriend named Jack, and there's suspects all over the place, and then here's where it gets weird. Ultimately, I'm just going to give away, whatever. Um, ultimately, it's not this uh, ex-client of hers who's stalking her. In fact, the ex-client does show up at the end, 
And it looks like he's going to do something to her, but then he apologizes to her. I shouldn't have said those things in the courtroom. I was wrong. I was just mad and frustrated. I still maintain I'm innocent, though. Um, but then her boyfriend, Jack, comes in, and Jack beats up the guy. And he's like, don't do that, Jack. He was just coming to say he's sorry, blah, blah, blah. Well, then Jack starts to almost like assault her. It turns out Jack is the stalker who's been sending her all this stuff. The motivation behind this, I don't know. I couldn't quite grasp that. Um, then Emmanuel comes in and hits him with a vase and then knocks him out and then he gets arrested and that's the end of that so and then she ends up having uh sex with her new client uh russell i think is his name russell wilson not the quarterback um and he's the one who actually had been accused of kidnapping this girl anna or whatever now here's where it gets weird at the end of the movie the last scene um uh, she said anna wasn't kidnapped i am anna we're the same what the fuck does that even mean i don't know um uh, there clearly wasn't anna but I don't understand. Maybe I missed it. I don't know. But anyway, that's it. That's Emmanuel Jesse's Secret Desires. If somebody else can explain the plot to me, go right ahead. Um, good luck, though. There's very, very little information about any of these Emmanuel movies online. IMDb just has a short little blurb, and that's it. And it looks like it was a sort of translation from a different language because it's not good English. It's broken English, and it doesn't make much sense. So, But yeah, good luck finding any other reviews of this movie other than this YouTube review for it. But I can tell you there's a lot of nudity in this movie. There's a lot of uh, softcore sex in this. And this one's pretty dirty, to be honest with you. There's some there's some vaginas in this movie. You can see some nice slippage vaginas. It's all there. Um, I like that. Uh, that's the only reason you watch this kind of shit. Um, but yeah, Natasha Vermeer. You know what, Natasha Vermeer, I don't think she had any nude scenes in this movie, to be honest with you. Maybe she did, but... Anyway, like I said, she was not the focus of this one. Beverly Lynn was. Now, Beverly Lynn uh, did a lot of these types of movies. I was trying to get confirmation that she may have been a porn actress, but I couldn't quite... Don't know for sure if she was, but she did a lot of stuff, so maybe she did. I don't know. But anyway, that was the second of the Emmanuel Private Collection films, and... Uh, and, uh, yeah, that's all i got to say about this one. So, it is available on this DVD. Now, this DVD collection, it's PAL DVD. It comes from, like, the Netherlands or something. Um, this used to show up on eBay quite often, actually, and it was reasonably priced, maybe 50 bucks or so. But I think it's starting to uh, dwindle uh, in its uh, availability now. So, uh, you might have a little more trouble uh, snatching this up. It's available on a couple other different compilations, and I think individual discs are available out there, too. So, it's out there uh, if you're looking for these movies. So, but anyway, that's it. Um, Natasha Vermeer, Emmanuel, Jesse's Secret Desires. Anybody else seen this movie? Anybody besides me? I've seen this movie twice, actually, in my life. How many people can say that? Check it out. Leave some comments. Watch it. Bye.